Right, hello, just thought I'd do a little video today. I've got a, a new headline coming today, which is uh, a blue, um, a bit darker than the blue of the car, but uh, a blue headline, so I thought it'd be a bit different. So before I uh, fit that, which will be in the next video, um, I'm just fitting some, as you can see, soundproofing, which I've had some of it on, done on the car before, I put it around the boot area and stuff like that. Um, but I've just received a new pack today, which is this dodo mat, which you can get off eBay or obviously their own website, which is really good stuff. Uh, so I'm just doing it just in the panels before I put the um, headlining back on, just to take out a little bit, any bits of noise so you can hear it you can hear a difference actually to be fair when you do it so this bit's not this is the last bit i've not done yet so you can hear if you listen you can hear the echo and this is a bit with it on so it does work and like i say it's not the most expensive stuff on the market i think this is on ebay is eight sheets i think it is or ten sheets for Nineteen ninety nine, and you can cut it up into any size you want to use it on camper vans and uh, various things like that before they, they line them and that but it is good stuff it's easy easy to put on just peel and stick you just got to push down uh, the edges the seams to make sure it's it's sealed all the way around but apart from that it's easy you can cut it as, as small or as many times as you want it doesn't affect it got full panels on the big part of the roof in the middle I've had to cut down where the sun visors go cut these a little bit smaller at the back and then obviously the same size for the very back bit of the roof here but um, yeah just thought I'd do a quick video just in case anyone's thinking of doing it I thought while well, the headlining's out it makes sense so that's what you need Dodo because we all know these uh, project drive Rovers, a lot of soundproofing was removed. Um, so at some stage, I'm going to do behind the doors and stuff as well, and under the floors. Obviously, I know they never had the soundproofing in the roof. I don't think maybe the old 200 bubble did R3 one, but um, I know the the later ones didn't, and certainly the pre, um, Project Drive cars never did. So. Hopefully it'll just make it a little bit quieter and a bit less tinny inside once it's all done. You get, get less road, road noise from the boot now because the boot was done a couple of years ago when I first owned it. Um, and that's definitely definitely quieter. So hopefully now the cabin will be a little bit quieter from the roof anyway. But just anyone thinking about it, definitely for 20 quid, if you've got your roof lining off, might as well do it. <laughs> It's not going to do any harm, is it? It can only improve things, and obviously this is all hidden when the headliner goes on. Um, which I will do in another video, and I'll show you at a later date. Thanks for watching.